The state of Michigan is ordering a Metro Detroit landfill to give its neighbors some relief. The odor emanating from Oakland Heights landfill got so bad it is requiring a change to daily business. Local 4 Business Editor Rod Maloney live with the story. And Rod, I, I'm guessing we're thankful this is not smell vision uh, yeah, it's a good thing. Now, it's not so bad out here tonight, but uh, they are saying that summer breeze out here is taking on a whole new meaning. Now, <laughs> they're calling it an old factory assault for the men and women who are out here who do their car meets. And you know what? The state is telling the landfill, you got to do something and make it fast. Retiree Ronald Schroeder's 1954 Plymouth Belvedere is his pride and joy. Rain or shine, snow or sun, he and his friends are out here polishing fenders and trading notes. And while they keep coming back, the smell of garbage, <laughs> you know, <laughs> rotten food, is getting too much to take. The only answer when the fumes get so bad their eyes water. If it's strong, we'll leave, everybody will leave early. In other words, he thinks he's going to run good business, it takes his business away because we all leave. Now, it is important to point out the landfill was here before they built the culverts. But the complaints about the odors picked up heavily in the last six months. Recently, it, it has got worse, yes. Joe Zimmer owns the culvers, wants to be a good neighbor, but also wants his customers comfortable. If I had my choice of not having it here, I would rather it wasn't. After it, numerous resident and business complaints, Auburn and Orion City officials called the Michigan Department of Environmental Quality, which came out and did its own monitoring and decided something really did need to change. Oakland Heights owners installed a new methane collection system that included drilling four new wells in the past week, and by all accounts, things have improved markedly. But a hot summer is coming. Well, it's just unfortunate yeah. the dump is here, but it's, it won't last much long, I don't think. What he's saying there is that he thinks that the life expectancy of the landfill is short. They're going to have to cap it at some point. But the guys who are out here doing their car meets say 15 times in the last six months, they've had to bolt early because it's just been too bad out here. The city is saying that they believe that it was a wet and warm winter that is causing much of this odor. Back to you. Oh, Rod, did the landfill owner have anything to say about this? Well, you know, we did contact them. We did hear back from their management, and they didn't, they didn't get back to us. But we have been told that there's going to be an additional reduction in odor out here with a new system that they're going to install starting next week. Yeah. All right, Rod.